guys Andrew here welcome back to Drew tutorial and if you're seeing the channel for the first time special welcome to you and in this video I'm gonna show you how to speed up all clips in DaVinci Resolve 19 so as you can see here guys I'm in DaVinci Resolve 19 here and on my timeline I have two clips now I'm gonna put these clips side by side right right next to each other now let's say you have your editing and you have multiple different clips that you have on your timeline and you want to speed up all of those clips then I'm going to show you how to ensure that you get this done now first I'm going to show you how you would speed up a single clip and how you can collectively speed up all clips right and there's just one simple step that you have to do in order to be able to do this to all clips but stick around and watch so for a single clip you want to right click on that clip and you will have the option that says change clip speed if you click on that you will see the section that says speed now 100 means that it is a normal speed of what the exact clip is and if it's less than 100 that means that it is slowing down and if it's more than 100 mean that it's speeding up now you can enter this value manually or you can simply left click and drag to the right or to the left and that's going to go ahead and speed up that clip right now let's go ahead and cancel for a moment now you can also do that by simply clicking on the clip on your timeline and once you click on the clip on your timeline go up to the upper right hand side on the inspector and you want to scroll down under where you have the video section and you will find speed change if you click on that you will be able to see the change speed and it basically does the same thing to the right you speed it up and to the left you slow it down right so i'm going to speed this up for a moment and show you that this clip is in fact speed up right so that's it now let me go ahead and reset this so that you can see that this clip is in fact slower so i'm going to slow down this clip and as you can see it is back now what i'm going to do guys is i'm going to simply press ctrl z so that i can get back the clip to the original speed so i have two clips here right this is the second clip right now in order guys to really speed up both clip the best the what you want to do is just highlight both clips together and you don't want to do chain speed i would first suggest that you highlight both clips or all the clips on your timeline you can simply click on one and then do a control a and you'll select all the clips on your timeline and then you want to right click on that and then you want to click on a new compound clip no, you can name it whatever, just simply leave it as that name and click create. And it's going to combine both my clips, or in your case, it will combine all those clips together. So once it compounds all of those clips, it's going to create one single video file. As you can see, this is two different videos combined into one. And so if you have multiple different videos, images, if you have text, everything on together on your timeline, if you press Ctrl A and you select all and right click and do a new compound clip, it's going to create one single clip no you can simply go back by simple right click on the on the clip and you can go ahead and you can do change clip speed right and then you can make the change from here or as i said you can go to inspect go down to change speed and you can change the speed of that single clip and as you can see i just do that so i will change it to about 200 percent yeah whatever so as you can see now i'm going to play this and the speed is there right i'm going to move it towards the end so that you can see so entire clip is speed up guys and that's it very easy and very simple here you have it guys i really hope you found value within this video and if you do don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when i release future videos just like this one thank you guys for watching and see you next time